What's up guys, it's Josh and we're back again with another video. Today's the day that I will be giving you guys the exclusive tour of my dorm room here at Yale. Without any further ado, roll this in. The porch like mom's not home. Tell me why the best things feel so wrong. Summer nights, love them how they take so long. Run with the feeling of being alive while we're jumping off the porch like mom's not home. Just a couple kids living on our own. Currently on the third floor of Timothy Dwight College. So we've got a bathroom over here, two quads, other people, and then my room. There it is. Look at that. Okay, I guess I'll just start from this wall. So up here we've got the obligatory for God, for country, for Yale banner. Then of course we have a world map. And a little bit of lighting to keep the room bright. Down right here we got a fan for when it gets hot. You can hang towels on the back of the door. Um, an extra chair that we're not using. A dirty clothes hamper. Alright, and then here is my desk. This right here. Where I've been spending most of my time the last couple days getting work done, but it's very functional, so let me show you guys. Of course, we've got the uh, the laptop, the mouse to go with it, and this is actually not a mouse pad; it's a magic pad, but it functions as a mouse pad too, which is nice. Um, we got a uh, super glue. <laughs> Don't know what that's doing there. Almonds and Swedish fish. Best snacks money can buy. Um, here's my student ID, all my keys to get into all the rooms and stuff. Um, deck of cards, of course, sunglasses, um, laptop charging cable. Now we've got some water bottles and some cups. That's what I take to the dining hall. Also, got my RTC water bottle, Nalgene, a little cup I got from the Catholic Center. And here on my whiteboard, I have my Class of 2021 sticker, my RTC sticker with my little Timothy Dwight pen. And then I also took the time to write a schedule of all my midterms and exams and their dates. So that'll stay up there all semester long, so I'll never forget. And then I just got a couple stuff hanging a map, a note, a letter, some other important information. And over to this side, I have my notebooks. I'm trying to stay organized with all my classes, as you can see. I think this was, this was multivariable calculus, first day of class notes. And the first problem set, that was interesting. Got my calculator. And then over here I've got my desk lamp, which also functions since it's kind of like a desk organizer. I've got my iPad mini right here. We've got pen, pencils, expo markers, charging ports, sticky notes, more charging stuff. That's pretty much my desk. Of course we have the chair, and we have my little laptop thing my laptop sits on, laptop sleeve. Um, then in this drawer, we've got some basic office supplies, um, extra light bulbs, and then all the random stuff that Yale has been giving me over the last couple of days from all the orientation stuff. Okay, another great thing about this suite is I actually get my own bookshelf. So let me show you guys that. So I'll start at the ground down here. Is a box, some extra magic stuff, my camera case. Um, laundry detergent, more water bottles, we got a little trash can, and this door, I don't want to keep it in here, just extra bedding I think. Um, we got tissues, we got some of my camera stuff, charging cables, lenses. Um, up here we got sunglasses, my baseball glove, all my hats, and then up here is a magic shelf, yeah. Here are my favorite deck. We got a bunch of unopened bicycles that I'll be using for performance. Got all my fancy decks over here, all my trick decks over here, gimmicks, rubber bands, sponge balls, um, and then of course the three magic books that make up like 90% of the information that I know. And then up at the top shelf, I've just got some random toys and stuff. Um, some more tissues. Down here at the bottom of the bookshelf, I have my camera tripod, which was just up there a second ago. 
Um, we got the microwave on the floor because the fridge hasn't came in yet. Some boxes. Um, here's our window. We got a fan on the window to keep it cool at night. A little photo collage that my family made me. Probably can't see that because of the lighting. And out here is the Timothy Dwight courtyard. You see that big tree right there? That is a ginkgo tree. It will be blooming soon, hopefully. Um, you can see out that way, there's the main courtyard. It kind of gives it like a little Independence Hall vibe. Right there's the dining hall and the library. Here's Jake's uh, bookshelf and desk and stuff. Not gonna show you that, that's his personal stuff. Over here we have the closet that we actually share. It's not very big. Oh, I got my towel, coats. Um, so here I've got all my shirts, jackets, ROTC uniforms, stuff like that. And then we've got storage area up top and room for shoes down below. If you move over here to the right, I have my dresser. So up on top, I've got some toiletries, wash towels, little Tupperware things to bring food back from the dining hall, my toiletries and stuff. Shirt stays for my ROTC uniform. Then we've got just clothes. There's my, oh, there's my Timothy Dwight t-shirt. Just got that a couple days ago. Um, just more clothes, more clothes. And then down here I have all my ROTC PT gear. Gloves, belt, hat, all that stuff. And here's Jake's dresser. And here's my bed. I'm on the bottom bunk. Got my pillows, nice bedding, um, extra blankets and stuff hanging over here. And then down below the bed is where I've stored all my shoes, the Vans, the Sperrys, the Flops, the Nikes. Got all that and we've got some extra storage space under the bed. And over here, I've got my backpack, which is pretty much empty right now because I've been working on stuff, but that's what I take to classes. I think that's about it, honestly. Give you guys a little 360 tour. Not super big, but luckily I do get to share the common room with the guys next door, so that's nice. Get a little more space to get some work done. I hope you guys enjoyed the tour. If you want to see more videos like this, uh, comment down below. Let me know. If you enjoyed the video, got anything out of it, um, drop a like and hit that big red subscribe button to support more content for me in the future. As always, I'll be back again with another video in the next couple days. See you soon.